G'day guys, just a wee disclaimer before the video starts. Um, everything from this video, the expense tracker, the Google form, and everything I'm about to show is all by Deborah. And I asked her if I could make a video on this, and she said she would love it. So if you'd like to use this yourself, you can go onto her TikTok, which I'll link in the description, and it has a video on how to um, install it, how to use it, how to update it, how to customize it, add it to your home screen, and everything. It has 2.8 million views, and... Um, the only reason I know about it is because my girlfriend sent this to me. Um, so it's been super handy. And um, yeah, I'll also link to her website, which she uses to um, dispose of all of her links and all of her other things, which she also has. But yeah, this video is going to be on how I track my expenses and how I use this to best um, benefit me. And I thought you guys would love it as you guys are keen money users. So yeah, let's get into the video. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, whenever you're watching this, this is Taylor Watts from Watts Investing and as you saw from that wee intro, we're going to be looking at an expense tracker and this is what I use to track my expenses. I've been using it since the 1st of September, so I just started Clean Slate on the month and now we're transitioning over to October, but I thought I'd show this because I've been finding it super helpful for just everyday use and just tracking my expenses and figuring out how I want to manage my money in the future. So basically you individually put in um, the day you buy something, you just go on your phone, you open this off your home screen, you click, oh, I bought it today, then I bought a drink bottle, and then you put, oh, it was cost $6, and we'll put that in shopping because it's buying something new and then bang we go down here to the bottom and we've got a drink bottle bought on the first six dollars shopping and then that goes in here and then it goes in here and here and you can just really easily see what's going on and then we'll just delete that row um so you can easily see what's going on month to month um kind of category to category with your spending so at the moment, I'm kind of using September, October as kind of analysis months. Um, as I have a road trip in November, which is not going to reflect pos uh, correctly on my normal spending. But yeah, month to month, I know that my food and drink spending is too high, um, as that should most that should be over there a bit more. As I'm living at home with parents, so I get mostly free groceries. But if I'm buying a bit too much like alcohol and junk food out at uni and stuff and then entertainment might be a bit high um, i don't know just yet and then we've got our savings and investment which as you can see down here if you tell them both up that's roughly 56 percent on both of those which is where i want to be roughly 50 60 percent um because it'll benefit me in the long term but yeah this expense tracker is super easy to use and um it just makes knowing what you're spending your money on really easy and it stops you from making some dumb purchases sometimes because you, you can just see how much income you've made and then how much you've already spent um, just from where you were at the start of the month and just go from there and yeah so you can just see the big table and you essentially just open the form on your phone put in what you've done and it'll load up on here and sometimes you'll miss an expense and you have to put it back and then all you have to do to put it in date order is just select everything and then click sort range, go to column B for purchase date, and then just go A to Z and it will sort it. Yeah, I decided to make this video because um, this video got pretty well received and I thought it was fairly similar. So this is a video on how I save and spend debt free. And that's essentially just talking about if I want something, how do I save for it rather than... Um, getting a loan for it or paying back something like that and it's just kind of a strategy that i use not all the time of course just most of the time and yeah i thought this would be mostly helpful for viewers that enjoyed this video so if you haven't seen that already go check that out if you want to follow my journey and see what i'm up to but yeah i thought i'd just share this expense tracker everything it entails and it has been updated uh to be version 2 so you can input your income a bit easier and it's a bit more customizable but everything will be linked in the description on how to customize it from deborah her tiktok where you can see her new videos and everything including her youtube of course and then her website which also has everything available 
And if you need any help tutorial wise or how to customize things, ask her. She'll be happy to help. And yeah, enjoy your guys' day. Happy investing.